Eating well helps you stay healthy, especially after a spinal cord injury. Damage to the spinal cord can cause many systems in your body to work differently, like your digestive and urinary systems, bones, and skin. Changes to these systems can in turn lead to other health problems. The good news is that many of these health conditions can be improved and even prevented by eating well. If you're aware of the different effects that foods have in your body, you can make wise choices. This helps give you more control over your body and helps you live to your fullest potential. Healthy eating doesn't mean bland, boring, or bad tasting food. In fact, a healthy diet includes a variety of tastes and, as much as possible, foods that are fresh and natural. If you want to see examples of fun, healthy recipes, click on the link that says Cooking with Pascal and you can watch celebrity chef Pascal Ribro prepare four delicious dishes that are specially designed for the health needs of people with spinal cord injury. In this course, as you learn how to prevent health problems by choosing the right foods, you'll see how healthy eating can be a pleasurable experience. A spinal cord injury can cause changes to the way your digestive system works. Making the right kind of food and beverage choices can help you stay regular and avoid constipation, bowel accidents, and other complications. The key to digestive health is fiber. It's important for a person with spinal cord injury to get enough fiber, at least 15 grams a day. An apple contains about four grams of fiber and a bran muffin contains about five grams, so you'll need several servings of high fiber foods to reach your daily requirement. Fiber supplements such as psyllium and bran cereal can help. Getting enough fluid is also important for your digestion. If you don't drink enough fluids, you could have slower, more difficult bowel movements. Certain medications like painkillers may cause constipation, while others, like some antibiotics, can result in stomach upset and diarrhea. Overall, getting the right amount of fiber is a good way to help maintain your bowel routine and prevent digestive problems. If you want an example of a delicious fiber-rich drink, check out Pascal's smoothie recipe. A person with a spinal cord injury needs to make sure they're getting enough fluids in order to help prevent urinary tract infections. You want to aim for at least one and a half to two liters per day. That's about eight cups. Water is definitely the best choice. It's available everywhere and it's cheap, refreshing, and calorie free. Other sources of fluids include things like milk, fruit and vegetable juices, smoothies, and herbal teas. You can also get fluids from coffee, pop, iced tea, and sports drinks, but try to avoid drinking beverages with too much sugar, caffeine, or sodium. Some people find that cranberry juice or cranberry supplements help them prevent urinary tract infections. Just make sure you drink pure, unsweetened cranberry juice that doesn't contain added sugar. For a fun drink that's good for your urinary health, have a look at Pascal's mocktail recipe. After a spinal cord injury, your bones can become brittle and fragile, and they can break more easily during everyday activities like stretching or doing simple transfers. It's important to keep your bones as strong and healthy as possible. You can protect your bone health with a diet that includes plenty of calcium, vitamin D, and magnesium. You can find these in foods like dairy, nuts, seeds, whole grains, beans, fish, and green leafy vegetables. You may also want to consider calcium and vitamin D supplements. You can also protect your bones by limiting alcohol, soft drinks, and caffeine, exercising regularly, including weight-bearing activities, and avoiding smoking. The food you eat has a big impact on the health of your skin. People with spinal cord injury need to prevent skin breakdown and pressure sores, and a healthy diet can help. Protein 
and foods high in vitamins A, C, E, and zinc help to keep your skin healthy and strong. You can find these nutrients in foods like carrots, squash, berries, citrus fruits, olives, green leafy vegetables, and sunflower and pumpkin seeds. If you develop a pressure sore, you can increase your intake of these nutrients to help the healing process. Drinking enough water is also important for your skin's strength and appearance.